All right, so this is going to be the best way to make reputation now using this like basically infinite reputation boosting glitch. Now you will need some money to do this glitch because it will actually cost you to rep up. Now for this, I also recommend having the personal vehicle storage. In fact, you need the personal vehicle storage, which means that you need an MOC. So you need an MOC with personal vehicle storage and a personal vehicle. Along with that, you'll need some money to actually buy the clothing items that you need to actually rep up. So from here, I'm calling out a Comet S2 and I'm going to actually drive that into my MOC to make it a personal vehicle inside of the MOC. This is just so that it's easier to actually hit a step in the glitch that is really early on. Now this glitch is very inconsistent when you're doing it the first time but once you actually hit the glitch it's pretty simple from then on. It is really important to do a step that I'm going to show you. So basically store the vehicle inside of your MOC, it doesn't matter if there's a vehicle already in there you should probably just use that one instead. So just make sure there's a vehicle inside of your MOC and you're going to use that one to actually hit this glitch right here. So from here, all you need to do is line up your MOC with the actual blue circle from the back of the MOC storage area with the blue circle from the LS car meet. As you can see, there is a blue circle from the MOC here. We need to align that as close as we can to the LS car meet circle. This is the most important step in this glitch because if it is not aligned properly, you will not be able to hit the glitch. So in order to hit the glitch properly, just look at this video right here and just make sure you get it lined up roughly where I am in the video right now. Now it does take a couple of attempts here and it's very hard to drive the MOC backwards I realized during this and you need to actually uh, just align the blue circle around there. You know what that is about perfect there and there you want to get it as close as possible to the actual LS Kami one like this. You can see the blue dots are nearly touching each other that's as close as I could get them then from here you want to request your personal vehicle from the MOC. Now we are going to drive very slowly from here. So I'm requesting my personal vehicle. Once it spawns I'm going to head over to it and I'm going to just pick it up and drive it close to here. What we are doing from here is we are essentially driving the car slowly up to the LS Kami area and as soon as we start to load into the LS Kami area we are going to actually spam right on the d-pad so our car stores in the MOC whilst loading into the LS Comic to confuse it to say that we're actually still outside so that we can purchase normal clothes. So as you can see here I'm driving slowly and as soon as it freezes to load me inside the LS Comic I start spamming right on the d-pad until I load into the LS Comic area. So basically once it loads you in if you did hit it correctly you'll see what I see. If you didn't hit it correctly then just go outside and retry them steps. So what you should do is you should get out of the car, everything should disappear for a second, stay still, it's important you stay still, wait until everything loads back in like this. Once everything is loaded back in, you want to head over to the clothing area inside of the LS car meet. So I'm checking around, everything's loaded back in, so what you want to do from here is actually head over to the clothing area. We have hit this part of the glitch and we are ready to move on to the actual part where we are making the reputation. Now it is pretty simple and it is a fast glitch. You will definitely get a hang of it soon, don't worry. And from here, as you can see, it says to browse any clothing item. You'll see that it's no longer the stuff that's normally in the LS car meet. It's all the regular clothing items because the game thinks we're still outside of the LS car meet. Now from here, as you can see, if I buy stuff, it will level me up just like this. And as you're about to see, it will cost you a lot of money from doing this glitch, which is why you will need to actually have a bunch of money on you. Good thing for you is that I have loads of money glitches on this channel that you can check out to make money. Now the crew emblem is by far the fastest way to do this. So if you need a crew you can always join my one. The link will be in the description. Now you can level up. I've gone from level 30 to level 100 in just about 10 minutes. And I managed to unlock all the awards that I needed. Now I think the max level for all the unlocks is 187 until you get to level 1000 for that uh, little outfit. Now you are going to get tons of RP and I think some of the levels will even give you money as well. So you will get some money back so you can purchase more clothing items. The cheapest ones I found were clothing items from like the base game like hats and stuff like that. They are the very cheap items like this. Stuff that's maybe around a grand piece like this, they're the cheapest items you can get. 
I know if you go to shoes, I'm sure there's some sandals and flip flops on there which are actually free and once you purchase them, it'll still level you up like this. So even if you are low on money, if you have the required items to actually hit this glitch, you can still level up quite a good few times before you actually run out of money. Now, as you can see here, the white air defenders are very cheap and they are nice to get. Now the crew emblem here, if you need one, join the crew. Link is in the description and all you have to do is go back to back on a jacket which has the crew emblem. Now this is the fastest way because you're not scrolling through lists trying to find clothing items to buy. You just go back and forth between this one. As you can see on my level counter, I was around level 30. I was 31 when I started doing this and I'm now level 107 and I am literally getting all the stuff that I need for this new DLC, the Tuners DLC that came out not too long ago. Please make sure you use this exploit as much as you can before this gets patched. When it does get patched, I will put it in the title. Don't worry. Now, I'm pretty sure you won't get banned from this. And if you do enjoy this glitch, please make sure to drop a like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.